The Chilling Adventures of Sabrina debuts on Netflix this Friday, and we're pretty excited to dive into this show. No, 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 not, not that Sabrina. Not that Sabrina either. The Chilling Adventures, the new one on Netflix. And honestly, I'll admit, I barely know anything about Sabrina. I mean, I've read the comics. Wait, hold on, hold on. All right, so we did a little digging and reading, and we're ready to dive into a brief history of Sabrina. The character Sabrina Spellman, a half-witch, half-human, first appeared in the comic Archie's Madhouse in 1962. Fans loved the character so much, they gave her the Teenage Witch comic in 1971. So Sabrina is a teenage half-human, half-witch, and initially she struggles to not use her powers for evil. Later editions made witches good, and so Sabrina just struggles with the mastery of the magic. The comic had three different runs, which led to the popular 90s TV show, and eventually an animated series in 1999. But we know what you're thinking. Is this new Netflix show the same goofy, funny Sabrina that we all loved in the 90s? I like the attention. Well, say goodbye. Harvey's here and you better start acting cattier. Mean. Of course not. The new Netflix series is based on the darker comic book, The Chilling Adventures of Sabrina, written by Roberto Aguirre Sacasa, with art by Robert Hack. Nicely done on that name, Leo. So it's a darker supernatural take on the coming of age witch series. This series adds horror. Thanks, by the way. <laughs> this series adds horror, the occult, more witchcraft, and a much darker tone into the mix for a scarier, spookier story. In the comic book run, The Chilling Adventures is split into two parts. The first focuses on Sabrina's struggle with her rise as a full witch and pursuing a normal mortal life with high school dances, drama, and of course, her super dreamy boyfriend, Harvey Kinkle. At Harvey Kinkle, super dreamy. But things are going to get even more complicated for Sabrina. Madam Satan has been summoned from hell and is back to take revenge. She's a former lover of Sabrina's father, Edward, and is out to get Sabrina and the Spellman fam. But our big question is, why? So the second part features Sabrina's father, Edward Spellman, and his mysterious revival from the dead, or the nether realm. We aren't really sure on this one. He poses as Harvey, that dreamy boyfriend of hers, to get back into Sabrina's life, which is a little weird if you ask us. And Sabrina learns necromancy, a dangerous and powerful magic that could lead her down a dark path. This new series looks like it's going to focus on Sabrina's high school drama, her journey to master the dark arts, and the fight against the dark forces coming to get her and her family. Sabrina's aunts Zelda and Hilda are back to help Sabrina with her magic, but they probably won't have quite as many jokes this time around. Some other characters are also set to return. Uh, we already mentioned her boyfriend, Harvey Kinkle, but then there's also the warlock cousin Ambrose, and don't worry, everyone's favorite kitty, Salem, is set to return as well. He was a witch who went a little too far and was condemned to a life as a talking black cat forever. The Chilling Adventures of Sabrina debuts on Netflix October 26, and we at Geekly Goods are ready. Be sure to like, subscribe, and follow Geekly Goods on all social media platforms, and grab something from our store. We take $1 of every purchase and donate it to arts education to keep arts in the classrooms. We'll see you next time.